Hey, Crypto Growth Fam, how's it going? This is your host Shahzeb signing in. We're back with another video, guys. In this video, we will be discussing Casper Labs never ending innovation it's going to be an interesting one guys so make sure to watch till the end and folks for those of you who are new to the channel we primarily discuss utility coins and potential gems so if you're interested in any of that stuff then subscribe the channel and hit the notification icon for regular videos and you can also support the channel by becoming a patreon so do check that out as well only if you're interested and folks keep your assets safe and for that you guys can check out the crypto growth the exclusive discount offer on on Descent, guys, you guys can check out their products, Biometric Wallet, which which has got uh, $50 off. Uh, Descent is convenient, safe, and secure. And you can also check out the Biometric Wallet 2X package as well, which has got uh, $129 off. Uh, if you look, follow the link in the description box below, guys. And uh, Descent supports uh, 3,000 plus of your favorite coins and tokens, 50 plus supported blockchain mainnets, guys. So do check that out. And let us begin, guys, with the price and chart of uh, Casper at the time of the recording, guys. So this is Casper Labs, and I wanted to basically uh, cover this because when I saw uh, the daily chart, guys, it was down 6.92%. Uh, this is not uh, just confined to Casper, guys. A lot of projects dipped today, yesterday, it's, uh, ever since that uh, BTC all-time high, guys. I really do not like this all-time highs of BTC because it tends to have so much volatility. Uh, I mean, the slow and gradual rise along with the other alts, I was uh, really enjoying that phase. Ever since that all-time high, guys, uh, the manipulation and the whales, they've gotten involved. A lot of mainstream media has involved after the BTC all-time highs. So I really do not like it when... A lot of mainstream eyes get uh, onto BTC guys and uh, crypto in general because it tends to uh, make the price uh, uh, extremely volatile. Check this out. We do not know what's happening. I mean, I, I saw a lot of projects, a lot of projects uh, here and there, guys, and a lot of uh, weird stuff is happening. So check this out. A Casper is no different. 7.71% 7 uh, down in the uh, in 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 the in the daily chart. It went as high as uh, 0 0.034 almost and as low as almost 3 cents, guys, 0 0.082852 at the moment, guys. So still dipping. Let us look at the seven-day chart. Yeah, check this out, guys. This was the dip I was talking about a few days ago. Uh, we do not know what's happening. I mean, the price fell from 0 0.035 all the way to almost, almost 0 0.2642 almost, guys. So two and a half cents almost. If you look at the monthly chart, it is down in the monthly as well. 42, 38.44% in the monthly. Uh, people are afraid uh, of uh, Casper at the moment because uh, it is it is now going on towards the uh, support, crucial support, the early support in the lower end, guys. So 0 0.02968, it, is, it has basically uh, broken this, but... This might be a false breakout, guys. This might be a false breakout. You never know. But uh, we should be prepared for if it if it is to get, go any lower as well, because uh, the sentiment is not very good when it comes to Casper. Although in the all-time chart, guys, you can look at uh, the support level 0 0.02531. I really do not see this going uh, below that guys. I really still believe in the fundamentals of Casper Labs and what it is doing. IBM wouldn't get involved with a project that has no future or no great utility. Check this out guys. What uh, what an opportunity if Casper is to become a giant in the future. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, not financial advice, that only 37.33% up from its all-time lows, guys. June 19, 2022, all-time high of Casper was $1.36. It is down 97.75%, guys. It is down significantly, but obviously you have to do your research and one has to have a lot of conviction in, in Casper. To hold it and hodl it with diamond hands i mean i know i know a lot of people get afraid when it comes to this sort of stuff because when other projects have boomed in recent times and you see your project basically in the red in the short term guys it it is not a good feeling i get that but uh, the idea of casper skies and fundamentals i told you guys i still believe in what they're all about targeting enterprises 
and uh, the innovative upgradability of uh, uh, customizability and uh, upgradability of Casper is top notch. Uh, check this out. Three forty five million dollar market cap, guys. It is nothing to be very honest for what it is doing. And check this out. The volume is increasing now. Twenty three point eight five. And in my opinion, this is not a sell pressure. This might be a buy pressure, guys, in my opinion. But uh, you never know because it is now testing a crucial support level in the all time as well it has touched that even in my opinion 0 0.025 uh, so yeah 0 0.026 anyways guys why do we believe in casper that it will do well in the long run guys check this out let me show you their official page official x handle in what ways does casper's upgradability set it apart from the other blockchain uh, platforms so this is a, a, a question that uh, i get time and again uh, that uh, what makes a certain project uh, different from any other project guys a blockchain platform and how does this contribute to its long-term sustainability in the rapidly evolving blockchain landscape so let us look at this modular structure for constant innovation uh, posted on april 12 2024 so latest guys check this out april 12th innovation is a never-ending journey that requires the ability to adapt and be flexible Casper was designed with this in mind. So on the get-go, guys, Casper was uh, was uh, made and uh, uh, made flexible, and uh, it was made for innovation in this never-ending journey, guys. It was designed this way. It was constructed this way. Casper was designed with this in mind, utilizing a modular structure that allows it to ev evolve and grow over time so over the course of time guys it will continue on to grow we are not seeing the small steps at the moment especially when it comes to price action guys uh, small things uh, are neglected we only focus on the price to be very honest and it is fair for the investors but the, uh, I really believe in the projects that have that provide uh, that want to revolutionize and transform this space for the good. The utility projects that are doing something for for the industry as a whole, meme coins aren't wouldn't be able to do that with, despite uh, giving a lot of gains, guys. It is not good. Uh, why is that? Because, guys, we need to be taken seriously, like share stocks. You have seen such low price movement in stocks most of the time, but still, people believe in it. It has matured. We need good projects to evolve and grow for this to happen in this industry as well. So, anyways, and projects like Casper are uh, paving the way, guys. They are in the front. Uh, they are in the front seat. They are in the uh, and we are in the passenger seat. Basically, they are driving. Let's see where they lead us. Our innovative structure sets Casper apart, enab enabling it to introduce new features and make updates without disrupting the entire system. Now, this is the create uh, keyword, guys. Uh, it can make updates without disrupting the entire system. A lot of projects uh, basically have to halt everything for it to make an update. Uh, how would this basically, uh, how would a business deal with it? I mean, you will tell the business or an enterprise that, no, we need to halt your business or whatever you're doing to make an update. I mean, that will disrupt the entire system, guys. And casper is able to do those seamless updates easily check this out this is a really good example imagine being able to modify your car while it is still running or even making it go faster without taking your foot off the gas pedal uh, a pedal and or regulatory comp i mean what is this anyways so uh, this is a really good example guys you're basically can modify your car without uh, stopping it wouldn't that be revolutionary? This would be this would be so seamless, so great. So Casper is optimized for that. Check this out. This agility allows Casper to stay current and responsive to the needs of developers and businesses that builds on it. I told you guys already that uh, businesses would want this, developers would want this. I mean, they do not want uh, constant uh, breaks, constant constant blockades, guys. Uh, any business uh, from small businesses to larger enterprises anyone no one nobody wants disruptions basically in a nutshell guys ensuring its long term long term viability people will want to develop on it people would want to use this because they why would they use anything that they constantly uh, have bugs in without being sorted out casper solves those things Plus, our modular design positions Casper to take advantage of the latest and greatest innovations in the industry as they emerge. 
uh, this is the uh, why we, we will we are calling it a never-ending innovative machine guys because as new technology comes it, it will seamlessly integrate with casper this even extends to the type of proof of stake consensus mechanism being used to append the next block on the casper change chain constant innovation guys beyond the core protocol Casper's smart contracts offer security and upgradability at the same time, giving developers the ability to perform bug fixes and improvements to the contract after it has been deployed on chain. Like I told you guys, this is especially important in the case of critical bugs or vulnerabilities that need to be addressed in a timely manner. Yeah, there are critical bugs as well. They need to be sorted out soon. I mean, if you halt everything to sort them out, that will create a mess, guys, for the businesses, for the enterprises. Why would they want to want to use such a platform, guys? Casper's upgradable smart contracts also allows for the contract to be updated to reflect changes in business requirements or regulatory compliance. I mean, up, uh, upgradability in the dApps, the upgradability in uh, the smart contracts, the upgradability in the network. This is a part of parcel of what Casper stands for and why I am bullish on it despite those these dips and the sentiment, bearish sentiment, guys. This enables a seamless integration to existing business models, tech stacks and processes or the creation of new blockchain native applications and a smooth migration to blockchain. So this is awesome, guys. This is awesome, in my opinion. The constant uh, the, the reminder that we get from the Casper team, I really like it. Uh, and they're constantly doing marketing as well. They went to Paris, uh, I think. Yeah, uh, great week wrapping up Paris blockchain block week. We're going to be uh, checking this world tour out as well. Uh, Casper's tour continues. Next stop, Dubai. Catch me at Token 2049 in Dubai next week with more than 10,000 participants, 4,000 companies, and 70% level participants. This event is among the largest in the industry and is occurring for the first time in the UAE, which is extremely uh, uh, compliant and uh, digital asset friendly, crypto friendly, guys. So innovation friendly, so to say the least. So uh, Casper in, is in the right location, is in the right region at the moment. So yeah, we're going to be covering these as well in our future videos. So, guys, what do you guys think about uh, Casper being an innovation, uh, being innovative for the long run? And uh, do you believe in it despite the price action? I know the sentiment is bearish; people are uh, not happy. But what do you guys think? I would like your opinions. Uh, so, do hit the comment box below and let the community know. Anyways, guys, this was it for the video. If you liked it, make sure to like, share, comment, subscribe, and hit the notification icon if you're interested in utility coins and potential gems. And you can also support the channel by becoming a Patreon, so do check that out as well. Uh, like I always say in the end, until next time, stay blessed and stay tuned. Thank you very much, everyone.